welcome. We're looking at the good newspaper again this month, and this time it's the Easter edition. And the headline is The Day That Death Died. So we're looking at different types of death. So stick with us. Andy, over to you. Yeah, hi, hi Colin. Happy Easter, everybody watching this. Uh, the April edition of the Good News newspaper, full of Easter stories. And there's a great article in the middle by a guy called J. John. You might or might not have heard of him. Uh, he's an Anglican minister, a very intelligent guy, travels around the world, uh, speaking to people about Christianity. And he's written this really interesting article, which is entitled Why I'm a Christian. And he looks at the, and it ex he explains why an intelligent guy in his 50s has devoted his life to traveling around the world telling people about Jesus Christ. It's a highly convincing article. He talks about believing uh, in the evidence of the resurrection. He talks about Jesus fixing his life. And he talks about the fact that Christianity works. So uh, if you're not sure uh, about becoming a Christian or maybe you, you, you're curious about what Jesus, what all this stuff about Jesus Christ is, the Easter edition is very clear. Jesus Christ rose again from the dead at that first Easter. And you've got people like J. John in the paper telling their stories of meeting, encountering God uh, through faith in Jesus Christ. Colin. Thanks, Andy. Yeah, looking at this uh, death thing, I, I had a relation who used to keep saying to me, well, you can't prove anything to me. No one's ever come back from the dead. Well, the amazing thing is, as this article points out, someone did come back from the dead and it's Jesus. And surely if someone comes back from the dead, we should listen to what he says. And, and thinking about death, you know, we often just think about the physical, obviously, the physical death. It's a, a massive separation for us from all our loved ones. Um, but there's also um, what the Bible calls a spiritual death, which means that uh, we're separated from God and we're separated from God by the things we do, our selfishness, what the Bible calls sin. Um, the things that we basically not perfect on, we, we let people down and we let God down all the time. That's a separation. That's a spiritual death. Uh, but there's also um, other forms of death or loss or, or breakages in, in our lives. And, and this uh, other article I'm interested in here is, I've picked up here, is about the, the, the woman uh, me, who played Mary in the Netflix series, The Chosen, who, who talks about a form of emotional death, really. She talks about here that she was, at one point, she was broke, depressed, and considered giving up her dream of acting. Um, but that all changed as she started to play this role of Mary in The Chosen. And I must recommend The Chosen to you. It's an absolutely magnificent um, uh, series. It really is. It really brings the whole Bible story alive and, and makes it so real. Um, anyway, she talks about how playing the life of, of Mary made such a difference to her. And she says, my eyes are opening on how wonderful life can be now. And I've got a sense of joy and peace. You too could have that. That's what the real meaning of Easter is all about. Andy, over to you. Yeah, so just to say, uh, if maybe you're a Christian watching this and you're looking for something to give out for your Easter services, looking for something to give away through your Easter events, uh, follow the link at the end of the video. We'll gladly send you a free copy. But the Good News newspaper Easter edition, great for using in conjunction with your Easter outreach from church. If you're somebody who's not sure about the real meaning of Easter, uh, you wonder, did Jesus really die? Did Jesus really come back to life? What are Christians on about? Um, please get a copy of this. Again, we'll send you a copy. Follow the link at the end of the video. And we want to wish you all a very happy Easter. And uh, we trust that you'll all come to understand the real meaning of Easter, which is that Jesus died and rose again. Thanks, Colin. Oh, 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 oh,